questions are really important i think because when we maybe are hearing something we maybe don't agree with questions are a great way to challenge rather than assuming or judging their answer one of the things that i encourage when people you know maybe are struggling with something they're being told is ask questions so things like what's the impact of that if we do that so what you're doing is you're understanding why they're saying what they're saying why they're meant to be maybe pushing on a certain point and it could be there's pressures on them it could be anything right questions are really powerful in terms of and only and, and, and actually i could use them more and i always look back and i think i could use them more you know instead of actually saying oh i don't agree with that or can i challenge that i would probably ask i'll probably you know my, my my training for me my own development is ask a question like so you know, like i said what is the impact if we did that what would happen what's potential outcomes I want to just see whether, you know, where it's coming from, but also whether my thinking's aligned with their thinking and whether there's any potential ground for, like, the win-win we talked about with Stephen Covey as well, like, because in every interaction, and as you said, Lee, I think you, you did it in your journal, that you want to leave every interaction and leave people in a better place than when you, when you found them, yes. right? I think that's what you had, right? Now, the only way to do that is we can all go on this path to say, I'm going to go and treat people and i'm gonna you know, leave them in a better place but when we that's that's okay when it's easy right that's okay when we are agreeing with people whether when we when we share a similar thinking uh, thought set or we're quite similar types of people the challenge comes when you don't agree with somebody how do you still reach that point of leaving them in a better place right so and i think the best place to do that is through questions to, to ask and and really be open to their point of view because actually they might have a valid point that you not thought about and you just assume that your point is correct and it may not be correct and i think there's got to be a bit of humility in there as well which can be quite challenging because we talked about on this podcast as well about the ego and how that can get involved so there are a couple of things in interactions is one part of the ego two ask questions and three find out where they're really coming from and be prepared to learn <laughs>